Hi, welcome back to the channel. My name is Demac and welcome to the Let's Play of the um, John Tiller Software Panzer Battles Kursk, the Southern Flank. We're playing the Prok Afghar Prelude July 10th here. This is part uh, 16, 17, I'm not sure actually. <laughs> Quite a lot of parts to this battle. Uh, the battle itself, not big, but there's loads of units. So, and uh, 20 turns is not that long actually, but considering there's so many units here, um, it takes a while to complete the turns because every, every unit has to move and fire, and you need to plan your strategies and tactics. So it takes time. Anyways, uh, turn 15 here of 20. We're already in the previous video uh, been doing a lot in turn 15 here, and we're going to be continuing. So, so we get to zoom out here a bit. Yeah. So the big picture is we've smashed through here with the Tottenkopf division. We built the bridge. We got the armor across and everything. Taking these positions, this high hill, hill to to 6.6 .6 here. We're about to gauge the last uh, defensive positions here. Taking the Cosmolets farms and the Cosmolets and Hill 241. And this division here is uh, this is is this the Lieberstein Lieberstein out of, out of Hitler? Yeah, they. Um, are already attacking here till 252.2 where the lead elements of the recon forces have captured this objective here of 250 points so we got this these two left here oh, Oki Braski and Hill 252.2 high ground over here uh, we'll see what he got here We've got five turns not sure we'll make it there in time but uh, we'll see he is counterattacking with some armor here. Well, actually, he had some hidden armor here in the Polovka woods. He hasn't committed them yet. He's just uh, he's sitting here below this this uh, little gully here with woods, some villages here. So uh, see what happens here. We got I got some recon forces going to be coming around here and see what's going on on this side. Maybe hit this village here. I do have units quite close actually. I should make him commit some of these units here and capture this. It's 100 points, but still. Right, so we're part, uh, turn 15 here, right? So I think I did all the artillery. Yeah, it's been done. So I'm um, currently moving units, I think. Let's do that. Scroll through some mov movement units here. And uh, start off with that at least. Uh, let's see here. We've got some stuff here. Yeah, these guys are all um, coming across the bridge here. This headquarters here. They could move up. They're in travel mode. So, that's okay. Some heavy guns here. It's kind of dangerous to move here. It could be fire at me from these positions here. They are in travel mode, so... Move these guns here. It's a chance at... Get the stuff up fast here. We do have some infantry guns that are going to be crossing that bridge. These guys are not in travel mode for some reason. Let's get them across. A bunch of mortars here. We need to move up. Sort of falling behind here. What's this? Seven guns. So they are part of this. Yeah, might as well move them there. Southern direction. There, we do have some of these noble workers here. I want to see if they how how good they are. They're in pretty good range now, actually. Should set them up there. Definitely good range for this. So let's st start putting these up. Start setting them up there. Um, these are more heavy. They're they got some good range. Yeah, they can still reach those positions there. Right, what else? I'm sort of jumping ahead here a bit. Let's see. Anti-tank guns. Light anti-tank guns. Well, let's move them down here. Move the headquarters here. Um, the Panzer headquarters. Anti-tank guns. Whoops. That was kind of careless. Right, we do have Panzer Grenadiers moving up here. 
Well, this is interesting. This is what we want to take here. Let's move them in this general direction here. Yeah, those engineers are holding... The These guys have fa max fatigue, apparently. That's not good. Let's get them up and deploy them. Hope hopefully I can use them. Because I'm 88. Well, we're going to get those on the hill here. Some good uh, coverage there. Got some engineers. I'm going to wait with them. All right, these guys. We're going to be taking this artillery position here, I think. Let's move this Panzergrenadier platoon in that general direction. Uh, these guys will continue forward here a bit. Let's get these anti tank guns up. Let's put in these trenches for now. Right, let's get these machine gunners up. 88. Hmm. Yeah, it's dangerous here. It's got positions here still. There's two 88s here. Let's get them deployed there. So we can lay down some fire on that. These machine gunners are part of those engineers. Wow, this guy is really far behind. Start moving it up a bit there. Right, engineers. They're going to be shot at there. Maybe we should take the lead elements for. The yeah, they fired. Okay. Let's get them over there. Eight anti-tank guns. How far can they move and deploy? Yeah, those guys are uh, bridge engineers. How far can these guys move and set up? Twelve flak vehicles there. Right, these heavy guns, what can they see from here? Well, they can see these positions, so they're actually going to be off travel mode and start hitting these heavy points here. Right, we've got some engineers. They're on the move there, moving very slowly, fortunately. Here we go. Some panzer grenadiers here. Right, the armor, let's see here. The panzers. Let's see how far they can move and actually so do we have a sizable force going to be smashing through here. I'm going to be funneling these guys a bit in this general direction, I think. So let's move this armor here. Gauge this position. This whole uh, tank regiment company. It's not that strong, actually. Take some heavy hits prior to this battle. Right, let's get these guys up. These lead elements moved? No, they haven't. All right, let's have a look at these guys in first. Um, well, just just uh, move forward here with these units. Okay, they got a hundred fatigue there. Not the best. We got a bunch. Even have those flame tanks there. Let's get all these guys forward. We can actually salt that position there. I took casualties there. Take this armor. Just stop moving forward. These guys are pretty decimated. Um, right, take some incoming sh incoming shots there. What else? Eight anti-tank guns. Right. Uh, maybe get them down here. And tank gun deployed there. Right, two mortars. Let's move them up. Move that headquarters there. Some flak guns. It's pretty slow movement there. Right, two panzers. Let's move them in. These scout cars. Leave them there. Got these panzers here. 
What's he got here? Double digits and double digit headquarters and the mortar team there. Right, where to move this stuff? We're gonna have to take care of this armor down here. This is an annoying position here. He's got isolation though there. We could go for an assault. Not sure though without uh, proper infantry support. Could be very dangerous. Eighty one recon dudes here. Might have been hit there. Lost a man. Right, these mortars are on the way to the front. Three anti tank guns gonna be good. Maybe you should move them with that with that unit there actually. They need some anti tank support there. All right, what about these? How far are they have they come? What is their range here? Well, these are important positions, but we really need to have some artillery that can reach here as well. These rockets. So I'm actually going to be moving them. Even further before I set them up. Panzer Grenadiers here, moving in the woods. We do have this. Headquarters here, sitting tight. Let's get these machine gunners up. Continue moving along these roads here. We do have some more rockets here. Should get them in range. What else? 17 guys here. They're part of them. They're gonna be hit, but I think there's only one T-34 left there. We've got these mortars. They're gonna be taking that apart. Right, these mortars. Mortar teams are gonna be moving up. Being hit there. Tigers. Well, let's move them up one step here. One tiger here. These Panzer Grenadiers. We'll leave those flat guns. Gonna leave them there. Right, these guys are sitting good there. Uh, what we got? We just got some motorcycle recon guys here. Yeah, I don't know what to do with these guys. Maybe they should swing around as well. Let's get these flag vehicles moving with this group here. Got these martyrs here. I'm gonna move them up in this hill, actually. Let's see. All right, these guys are gonna be, gonna be bugging out with these guys. Because I wanna see if he moves up. He probably will. Let's get him over there. Let's try to lure him up there. Two guys left here. Part of that. Let's look around a bit there. Get these mortars up. Alright, he's got something there. Look at that. T-34 is dug in in Vinogradovka. A little cheer. Yeah, so this is going to be tough. He probably has some strong points here. All these uh, recon dudes here. Probably minefields here. These engineers are clearing mine. They actually did clear it. That's cleared as well. I'm actually going to be moving them here. They're going to be smashing through here and try to get, grab these positions fast. Right, so is this one in range? This one's actually in range here. I'm going to set it up. We got loads of stuff here. Well, at the start of this battle, I actually thought that um, I didn't have. I thought I had very few units co compared to the Russians here, but now that I've been playing a battle here almost to the end, it. Do 
do have a really sizable force here, actually. These uh, three uh, SS divisions are pretty big. All right, engineers to the frontier, clearing mines. Three of these small anti tank guns. The Stugs. Uh, what's he got? Four left there. Maybe we should start engaging them, actually. Try to smash this arm here. One, two, three. Three range there. It's pretty good range for the for those. Alright, what do we got? Let's try to sneak by here. Like that. Even more machine gunners here. I think we're going to have to stop moving on foot here to get across this uh, rail encampment here. Right. All right. Good movement there. Let's just run forward and see what happens here. We bump into anything. Hmm. All right. Nothing there. Right. So let's see here. Those engineers have cleared mines. I want to put them on foot, actually. Right, there's no mines on the other side there. Let's get those guys off travel mode. And let's put them on foot as well. They're going to be going across there. Four guys here. Uh, let's get them on foot. One anti-tank gun. Wow. All right. One very light anti-tank gun. Whoops. Perfect. Three anti-tank guns here. All right. So there's mines here, probably. Definitely mines. Could be careful here. Uh, we do have a breach there, so maybe I should just. I wonder if there's mines there. There could be mines there. Let's actually move them like that. Whoops. It disrupted, so I'm not particularly afraid of those guys there. Um, let's divert something down here. We do have this coming down. Let's actually take one more platoon down there. That means we're going to have to put these guys on foot. Let's get them down there. What do we got here? Some engineers. Guess those flak vehicles can stay there. Right, these engineers also go on foot. Now, I don't think these can actually drive across there. Yeah, even though I put it in travel mode, it's, yeah, they can't cross there. So this probably they can. It's a ditch. Now there's ditches here. Maybe around here. But I'm not going to do that. They've basically done their job. They're just we're going to be driving around here and doing some scouting. Let's get them up there. So many units here. Let's get those lead half tracks up there. Some of these flak vehicles moving as well. Right, 100 guys here. Well, these guys are pretty stationary. They're in, uh, they're in the clear, actually. Maybe they're moving? I'm not sure, actually. Uh, let's see, what do we got? So let's take these guys here, put them on foot, and let's move across. They're going to be attacking this general direction there. Armored cars. See if I can do some scouting here. I don't think there are any units here, actually. 16 guys. Here comes the Panzers. Let's 
Yeah, they yeah, they can't cross here either, can they? No. It's kind of a waste moving that armor up here, actually. Could build a bridge. Ah, that's what those build those bridge engineers were for. These guys. They they made to the make bridges across these ditches here. Now I know. Okay, good to know. But I probably will not need them, so. Um yeah, what to do with this armor here? Maybe I just swing it up and start attacking. Uh, attacking this positions here. Let's get there. Those gonna be holding back there. Like that. All you must consider. All right. So look at firing. Uh, right. Big guns here opening up. Those guys are not disrupted there. Only one man. We lost a gun. We actually lost an 88 there. Two casualties. Right. Anti-tank guns. One anti-tank gun here. Fire at that position. Could lose it. Right, keep firing. No effect. Right, these panzers here will engage these. Uh, let's destroy those armored cars there. Wow, only fatigue. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Boom, being hit by some heavy katishkas there. Right, these panzers. They can't see anything actually. Hmm. Well, can I move them to a better position, maybe? I can. Not. Okay. Um, it's only that lead tank there. Well, let's get them off that and just move it up. Like that. Okay. What we got here? Well, they're going to be engaging this. Let's take out the guns. Fatigue. Lost a man there. Four man disruption. Ouch. Alright, it's attack. He's got men in there as well. Three men. Whoops. Oh, nine men. Jesus. That, those Katushkas, man, they are s slaughtering me here. Take these guys. Get that infantry disrupted there. Whoa! Boom! Six guys dead. Wow. It's insane. Only two guys dead. He's got some heavy guns there. Wow, we're being pounded by artillery here. He's got lots of artillery back here. What's he got in here? He's got infantry guns there and mortars. Right, what's he got? Double digit disruption here. We've got four guys in the machine gun platoon, 26 recon dudes, four flame tanks, and 10 more guys. Uh, let's do it. Let's, let's do this attack here. Why not? Let's see if we can take this hex. Oh, we get hit by Katishkas. Five men was killed. Oh, look at that. That's terrible. We lost two men. We lost four men and retreated. Wow. That is a decimated force there. Right, what do we got? We should actually move forward here. There's no point standing back here. Let's move up. I just hit my armor there. Boom, no effect. Let's take all this. Let's attack that infantry once. Six man disruption. No effect. Probably gonna be hit by those Katishkas again. Oh, fatigue. No, mortars. Boom. Let's take the armor. 
Let's see if we can take out uh, some guns. Two guns and disruption there. One man was killed. And we've got fatigue. Yeah. Wow, three men killed there. Okay. Uh, let's take these tanks. Can they assault? They can. He's got he's got some more he's got some mortars and some uh, headquarters unit there. We do have forty eight men and six tanks here. Should see if we can do an assault here actually. Mind you, these guys are very tired and taking some heavy heavy casualties here, but let's do it. Two men dead. Oh boom! Three guys killed. Wow, those Katishkas are firing like crazy. You lost two men in the gun. Two guns there. Alright, that was not so successful. Alright, what do we got here? Um Let's actually take those three tags. Let's move them in there and engage some armor. What's he got here? This is where he's got two T thirty four platoons. He's got some armored cars there. Let's take them and attack the T-34s. Knocked one out. Cause fatigue. Let's take these two light Panzer IIs. Uh, start working on this unit here. No effect. No effect. Right, these uh, three armored cars can work on that. It's only a single digit unit left there. Right, we're gonna go for an assault here now. What do we got? We've got 28 men. 19% <laughs> left. He's got single digit there. 108 fatigue. Let's do it. Let's go in there. Lost another man. No effect. Hit by mortars. No effect. There's two guys left defending that. Wow, they took it. Getting one step closer to that objective there. With 79 recon dudes. Let's open up here. Lost two men though. We're fighting here. Both those units are disrupted. Let's take those 39 guys and assault in here. Five men versus four, so we took the heavy blunt in that attack there. Four of these uh, heavy SIG 33 guns. Well, the only target they have are these um, Churchills here. Fatigue. Need to be lucky to take something out there, right? Eight Mata's here. Let's see if they can take take care of those last T thirty fours there. Only fatigue. Wow, they survived. Whoa, he even knocked one of them out. He's got one stubborn T thirty four there. Jeez, that is uh. Probably good tank crew in there. Some seasoned veterans from uh, way back. Just laying down some heavy barrages there. Um, right. Can these six flak guns do what the <laughs> eight modders couldn't? Probably not. Probably gonna lose a vehicle here. Yep, we lost one. Ah oh, well. Fatigue. Right, what about these big guns here? Not really meant for tank, but if I'm lucky, I might get take him take him out. 
stubborn T-34 there. Right, here we go. Pack 40s, two guns left. See if we can take out those Churchills. Just cause of fatigue. We've got five more uh, Pack 40s here. Hitting in the brush. Hey, knock one out. Fatigue. Big anti-tank screen here. Here we go, three Tigers. No effect. Fatigue. Wow, didn't do it. Uh, one Tiger. No effect. It's firing back. Boom, no effect. That was it. Right, here we go. Ten Matas. Can you take care of that? Stubborn tank, please. He's broken now. Whoa, been hit by artillery there. Lost. Damn, we lost a mod of there. Guess hit this. Only fatigue. Hmm. Right. Three pack 40s. He's getting some lucky defense rolls here. That's insane. The amount of fire raining down on those T 34s there. Four more pack 40s here. Wow. Sometimes I'm kind of confused on <laughs> the battle results here. I mean, there was so many guns firing at that single tank and none of them was able to knock it out. He must have been the luckiest tank driver in the, in the war. Damn, lost a gun there. Gonna be careless here. Wait, what about these two pack 38s? Wow. Okay. Okay, here we go. Seven Stugs. No effect. Wow, that is insane. Right, we've got six Stugs here. In Attacking these. Fatigue. And knock one of them out. Alright, good job. Okay. What do we got? Twelve vehicles here? Can they reach there? Nope. Sixteen guys. Okay. What is the range of these? Soft's five. One, two, three, four, five. So if they move... Here. Okay, what's up there? It's clear terrain. Oh, it's overstacked. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, so no. Let's take these recon cars. Actually, just leave them there. So that was all the firing there. How about barrages? Done that. Airstrikes? Yes, please. I do have some airstrikes. Okay, this is a pretty big. Uh, let's have a look here. This is a pretty big setup here. Can we put put an airstrike there? We can. We can do some carpet bombing there. Why not? Um, he's got some strong points here. But this is a worrying. These T-34s. Let's put a strike here. Let's put this fleet of corpse there. These stubborn bunkers still holding out here. Let's put some more strikes in these. Now, any other tempting targets? He's got anti-tank guns there. He's got double-digit mortars in that defending. He's got loads of mortars set up here. He's got some guns there. Maybe hit that artillery setup. Right. Maybe hit uh, this. We do have some recon. Let's keep doing some reconnaissance in this general area here. See what he got up here in this hill. All right, so let's see. Any more movement left to do here? Yeah, these were actually on moving up here. So these guys have not been released yet. This Panzergrenadier unit here. 
It's Totenkopf. Part of the Totenkopf there. Not released. Yeah, how can these guys move? Look these recon guys. Haven't moved them. Those bridge guys. Yeah, I'm doing some careless stuff, but we've got this major victory here, so it doesn't really matter if I lose some unnecessary units. It's not a campaign, so it's just a single battle here. So, All right, so what is it? 7 o'clock in the evening, 10th of July. Done most of the stuff. Just going to check. I think all the firing has been done, yeah. So should end the turn here. So not a lot happening here this turn. We've got some units across this ditch. They're going to be going for these two objectives there. Put together about two, three platoons of infantry going to be going for this. Do have this recon force moving in here. Don't really need to do it, but I'm going to see what he's got down here. be interesting to see if he pops some tanks up here now, because none of these tanks can see any, any of my units now. So he probably will be curious and move them up, hopefully. See what happens here. Send a turn. See what happens. Going into turn 16 here. Boom. And see what the fast AI uh, processing does here. Right, he's barraging. See what happens here. We are taking some vicious casualties now due to the, these heavy katishkas of raining down death on my troops. He had a mortar team down in those woods there. Whoa, th that recon team took some heavy hits there. Thought I spotted the seven casualties there. Right, here we go. Look at that. Uh, we're getting attacked there now. In the south. He's got some guns and placements there. Let's hope we can knock some of his tanks out. Hitting those positions good there. Right, that looks like the end. Here we go. Airstrike on those tanks. No effect on my planes. So one vehicle, one platoon is actually wiped out there. All right, here goes another strafing run of those stubborn bunkers there. No effect on the planes. 21 men killed. Jeez. All right, let's see if we hit those. Fatigue on my uh, two guns was destroyed. Okay. Recon is spotting some units on that hill there. All right. Turn 16 here. Air units are available. Smoke available 24. Bridge operations completed. Uh, where was that? Bridge operations completed. Um, yeah, th those bridges there. Yeah, the two artillery unavailable. One unit is undisrupted and broken. Out of four units checked. That's one of those units in the front there. Seven units recovered fatigue there. All right. See, so we're doing a time here. Right? We're running on almost 40 minutes. So just to summarize this. What's going on here? Wow, look at that. Yeah, I know historically they did mount a. Um, an armored attack here and so I've actually <laughs> moved <laughs> my static defense line uh, forward and now he's coming here with armor not a lot but some armor or we do have some tank guns here we don't have much in here actually I might have to take this recon force and set up some sort of defensive perimeter here so he doesn't smash me in the in the back here so he moved up those light tanks. I expected that. He still has some T-34s hidden here. He's got one of those churches left there. Three of them are burning there. Another three wrecks over there. He's got one left. It's disrupted. He had a mortar in, in placement there. All right. So the recon showed 30 plus guys, 40 plus guys there, 40 plus. About 40 plus guys there. And a headquarters unit. He does have guns on the top of that hill. Something in the village. One <laughs> T-34 
34 left there. Second tank core. This one is broken. Interesting developments here. Let's move that armor up there. It's kind of cheeky. Let's see here. What's going on here? Right, so. Wow, this must be a lot of guys isolated. I should have sold in these positions. I would have wiped them out. Should have had some infantry here, actually, in salt. He's all isolated here. Alright, what's he got left here? Single digit uh, tanks there. Five T 30s war force. There's five wrecks there. There's two wrecks there. Alright, he's moving some infantry here. He's got some stuff there. Interesting. It looks like a headquarters unit there. Got some guns. All right, we're going to be taking this, no problem there. But so it says seven thirty in the evening now. We're going to be moving something down to counter this armor here. I do have some tigers here. Battalion and a battery of Stug three Gs there. I do have lots of anti-tank guns as well. I think I'm going to be okay. I do have anti-tank guns here as well. Could be moving them through the woods here. Let's have a look at the victory conditions before I end the video here. Right, so he's lost almost 6,000 men now. 266 guns and 108 vehicles. We're actually casualties a mountain here. We've got 3.2... 3,000, about three, almost 3,300 men dead there. 73 guns, 42 vehicles there. Still got a major victory though. Climbing, the, the points are climbing very good there. Interesting, right. So I'm going to end the video here. And uh, we're going to pick up the fresh turn here, next video. Turn 16. So, um, lots to do. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And if you want to leave comments, please do. I'll answer them and um, get back to you. So I want to thank you for watching and uh, see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.